What's going on, it's Johnny, and welcome to They Are Here. This is an alien abduction horror game, I think based off of somebody's story that actually happened to them. Uh, so let's go ahead and jump in here. Here we go. Unexplained phenomena occurred at Gray's Wood Farm. On the night of August 7th, the Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at a breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction and in a different speeds. After a while, they vanished. This strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. According to the owner of the farm, all animals went crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him, and bit him. The children, the children complained that someone was walking under their windows. Farmer Peter Sherman himself, in the field, saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to oneself? Or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to Grayswood Farm to take a photo and make a report for the local newspaper. Listen, alien abductions, man, aliens in general, they exist. We ain't just gonna breeze past this stuff, baby. We, we, we know there's no way possible that we're the only thing existing in this universe. All right, no, no, no shot. If we exist, then something else exists. It's, it's a fact. All right, I got coffee. Hold on a second. Oh, that's hot. That's piping hot. All right. Oh, this game looks fucking sweet. Hold on. All right, graphics are dope. Like that. I'm assuming I can't just leave, right? Yeah, okay. All right, we're going this way. Got a flashlight? No. All right, we're just walking down the... All right, press left mouse button to take a photo. Oh. Look at that. Who are these? Do you see me down here? Huh? Do you see me down here? I don't, I'm not gonna hurt nobody. I'm just here to talk to somebody. All right, that's it. Golly. Look at this, bro. Are you see? I mean, look at that. That's crazy. Oh, things are about to pop off, son. Oh, God. Oh, we just started. Let's relax. Alright. Farmer Snow. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment if something bad happened. A daughter went missing. My wife went, down, went to town for help. My son and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the some police. And the police... In case we pass each other, be careful, Peter Sherman. But back. All right, inspect the house. Hello? Is there any aliens in here? Let's close that. All right. Not working. Phenomenal. Hello? We are here. Oh, look at that, like some family photos. Uh, old newspaper. Mystery sky object seen here in Orono. Down to Earth approach to alien visitors. I wonder if that's like an actual um, newspaper. Extraterrestrial hypoth hypothesis still unproved. Let's go upstairs, I guess, because I guess that's where we want to go. Hello? You're a dog. Right? That's a dog, right? Yeah, I hear a dog. Go in here first. Ugh. Oh, kind of like weird books and stuff. Farmer Children Diary. Sticker. Found my old diary from when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that? Diary tech. Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. I saw the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true. I was fishing from an abandoned pier on the river. Suddenly, I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around. Very low above the ground, a huge disc without with four flashing lights or windows was hovering. 
I felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the air. I froze there as if in zero gravity. Everything around me became blendingly bright and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing the three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicated with each other telepathically. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening and barely made it home. My head was buzzing and I walked home as, in, as if in a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts in my body and two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. Well, you got messed up. That's what happened. You took, you just, you got messed up. It took you, did some stuff to you, and they just messed you up. And that's okay. Well, I guess it's not really okay. Farmer's note, I've learned a lot about these things. They are called the Greys. These are not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous creatures. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head, disproportionate to the body, no hair, bottomless black eyes, gray skin, long, thin limbs. Their voices are like nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky near home, which move along a certain way. Then, people start to have a nosebleed, have severe headaches and buzz in their ears, and animals start raging. Next, people start to have memory lapses. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places, for example, in the middle of a field or a road, a few kilometers away from home. Some of them have flashbacks of terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences. The aliens establish control over their minds, and this has affected their psyche. Also, they found the marks on the, on the body, incisions to be exact. During palpitation, it felt like something thick, like a foreign object moved under the skin. Man. This is fucking creepy now, man. Honestly. Like, yeah, like, is, aliens do exist. For sure. Pro 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 from the internet, perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar to it looks creepy. Right, as I said, it looks... It looks creepy. I think they're all, they're all gonna say the same thing. I mean, look at that. Like, no shot. Ugh. Alright, we're moving, son. Nothing so far scary has happened yet. I'm gonna say that and it's just gonna start popping off like a mother. I don't know why they have needles and shit in here. Like, darts. Barbara's note, this is my daughter's room. During the night I had a I heard a strange noise. When I came in, she wasn't in her bed and the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. Well... No! Oh, come on! So did she, did she leave through that way? Yo, give me that. Walkie-talkie. Apparently it belonged to the missing girl. If you listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. Let's, let's give it a listen. Nothing really too crazy. Those are like little clicks. Oops, wrong button. Hello? What the f- There's a freaking alien inside my house! Or his house! He was inside! I can hear more outside the window! Hello? Oh, I got goosebumps now, boy! Oh my god! Oh my gosh. I am freaking out internally right now. They want me to watch this? Is this what's happening? Okay. That's not, is that that? 
Oh, I don't like that noise. I hate that noise. All right. Sure. Awesome. Well, we watched that. Now what? Those of dead animals. Probably like these animals from Grey Greyswood Farm. I am fish. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Farmer's note. As a child, headaches began to bother me. They tortured me to this day. I went to the doctor dozens of times, but no one could explain the reason for the occurrence. Now I understand why the doctors could not determine the cause of the migraines. The answer is simple. Abduction. I only remember the alien abduction when I found my old diary. It was then that the, the migraines began. The cuts that I noticed then behind the ear were a trace of them. I'm sure they've implanted something in me, some kind of transmitter, transmitter or implant. Because of this, I forgot everything. I definitely decided that I wanted to get it, that I would get it. I'm not crazy. A little drawer with a strange device. On the note, Peter Sherman claimed that he, that he cut out an alien implant. Maybe take it? Fuck yeah, take it! We're taking that thing all the way, son. Up, 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 up! Don't like that noise! Don't be doing that noise! Now what? Am I leaving? Oh my god! You're definitely outside. They're for sure outside. Hello? Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm freaking out, dude. I have so many goosebumps. Cannot do this right now. Hold the right mouse button to focus. It's my car. You know what? This is something's about to pop off. I'm getting ready for a thumbnail because I don't give a shit. <gasps> oh! I can't run. Run, 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 run to my car, run, run to my car, run, run to my car. Right now, that's where we gotta go. That's where we gotta go. That's where we gotta go. Okay. Um, we'll hit. Start it! Oh my. God, that's a big ship. Wow. Oh, that's fucking crazy. See how big that ship was? I mean, you're talking the size of that house four times over, five times over. It was massive. So what was the things in the air? Because they were just like small little bitty ones, unless I was just so far away. Maybe they were like super far away because that ship was huge. There's no way that they were up in the air like that, together like that, I, I, right? I have no idea. Uh, anyway, this is the full game. You will find the large territory of Grayswood Farm in a full story of an alien abduction. Add the game to your wish list so you don't miss this kind of release. Oh my god. Alright, guys, this is going to be. Uh, they're here. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and share your friends. As always, guys, I'm Mr. Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. I apologize for no videos here recently. I've been having a great time playing Seven Days multiplayer with my friends. And, uh, we played like eight hours some days, like, just non-stop played all. I mean, I just fell in love with it. It, it. It's just so good. We have, uh, one episode of Seven Days Multiplayer out right now. Uh, let me know what you guys think about that. Um, more content comes in the pipeline. Just kind of have to edit everything. I have 30 videos in total for Seven Days currently. And it's, it's pretty much about done. Uh, I have to edit it, most of it, but... I'll have that out soon, and yeah, there's more coming.
more of these little small videos. Probably gonna do another series or two before newer games start coming out, so... Perfect. Perfect. Be on the lookout. Perfect. See you guys soon. Bye.